everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome back. Paper Mario Color Splash. I have no idea what this is for. I want to say it's for the door, but it could be for any number of things. Oh, it was for this thing. Should have known. I'd like to figure out the key for that toad. I don't like fighting these guys anymore. So I don't need to waste two big items. There are three big items. Two is more than enough. Ooh, a lot of goodies in this. So let's see. I'm gonna use... I am running low on supplies. This should get him. Damn, if only I had a... If only I had, what's it called? Uh, what the fuck is his name? Shy Bandits. He was really heavy. Toad number 40. How many toads are on this damn train? That whole cart is bad, guys. Oh, fuck. These things. Um, don't I have a Koopa somewhere in here? There, I do. Koopa, and then some regular hammers, I think. Because these guys can totally destroy me if I'm not careful. Well, I did just save, so... I'm not so afraid to experiment. What the fuck is with these things? He's dead. God, they hurt so much! Now it's murdering time. There must be a way to easily kill them. Oh, maybe fire flowers would ignite the coal? health down there. Hello. Don't move a muscle. If you move, we'll shoot. Okay, I won't move. I'm curious. Okay, this is annoying. You moved! Eight sniffets? Really? Yup, eight sniffets. Let's see if we can't change that to zero. Oh, damn it, I just missed the cat. I have to wait for it to loop all the way around. How long it's gonna take to get you jealous of my mask? I wonder how long it's gonna take to get the Larry. Let's use that, and then maybe I should also heal if I have a regular mushroom. I do! 
Oh wait, but it's just gonna I should use the mushroom first. I'm a dummy. I just wasted a mushroom for no particular reason. What is he even saying? They're dead. Yep, wasted the mushroom. Great. Hard not to move a single muscle. What if your eyes get dry? We are rescue toad squad members 36 or 39. Be free, you little weirdos. Oh wow, leveled up. Hey, a key! I wonder if I come back to this level. I'm curious, if I come back to this level, will I be able to do this whole train part again? I could be getting some pro sombrero guys less annoying. Where's that briefcase? Who's in here? Oh, it's a whole stack of them. We're free. We really crammed with 30 of us in there, even if we were perfectly collated. Rescue squad members 30 through 32. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright then. Well, that makes a huge difference, getting 30 of them right there. see what this cabin full of... Are they friendly? Not friendly? Oh, they're friendly. Look at those bells have so much smoke, it makes it hard to see. Not to mention the environmental impact. If you were to elect me, Goomba, as Supreme Leader, I would be more environmentally friendly than your current Supreme Leader. Just saying. We shovel the coal, breathing in harmful toxins, and we're covered in smoke and ash. Oh, Mr. Larry just chills. Typical manager. Whenever I see the exhaust funnel on an engine, I get a weird urge to stuff something into it. If I plugged it, the smoke would stop coming out and I'd get into trouble with Mr. Larry. Seems like all these people have their own troubles, you know? Maybe we should take some time to chat with them. Bad guys are people, too. Later, nerds. Tell number 42 of the Red Rescue Squad report for duty. Are you gonna make them fight me? We come all this way. Won't you sit down and rest for a while? Sure. Mario, please lend me your ear for just a moment. Don't you ever wish that you could escape from the hardships of your everyday life? Take us, for example. Out of nowhere and with no notice, we're ordered to attack with train works. Or attack the kitchen. No rhyme or reason. Mario, every obstacle you've experienced has been the result of our hard and thankless work. Hope the guys upstairs realize just how much we actually do. Maybe next time, I'll just give them a straw and tell them how to get to work. I sit here and look out this window at the evening sky, worn out at the end of the day, every day, wishing that I could go to find some faraway place. To some, I'm stumbling all over. But I understand the reality. I'm in Bowser's armies for life, so I'll just have to give up on my dreams. Mario, I'll probably order to attack you someday, and it'll be bad guy versus good guy. There's no point in lying to ourselves. Thanks for for listening, Mario. I'm sure we'll meet again. Maybe his enemies. Mr. Larry, is it good? Taking a trip on a luxury train and getting to eat delicious hand-hammered hand meals? Hope I'm succe that successful someday. One day I'll settle down. Maybe near a pond, have a couple of kids, and kiss this fool's life goodbye. Oh. Oh, he didn't tell me what number you were. Forgot to introduce him. God, look at him running! Number 34. God damn, man. Got some great legs. Right, I'm pretty sure I've been thorough enough on this train. You know what? No, you have to be able to... You have to be able to come back on this train. Maybe it won't be moving, but... Because there were colored spots, weren't there? Am I imagining it? Alright. 
What was that? He didn't have any animation. Just slid across the coal. Hey, Lair. Took you long enough, pal. I'm almost done digesting that giant steak I ate. Bitch. Giant steak? So you're the VIP? You grill a mean steak, Mario. You should have been a chef. At least that way, you would have had a nice, long culinary existence. But instead, I'm gonna cook you up a tuna fist sandwich before we get to Starlight Cape. <clears throat> Lord Bowser expecting the big paint star, and I have no intention of disappointing him. He does have a little star inside of his head. Have you ever seen this disappointed? His disappointed face? It's heartbreaking. Enough small talk. Let's get this over with. Larry's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Ah, I love the smell of impending doom. It was my henchman who hijacked this train. It'll be my henchman who keep the train uh, hijacked. Alright, so we're just in the beat the shit out of you stage of the fight. So what do I have in terms of shit beating out of abilities? That. Or those. You know what? Let's, uh... Get a Ooh, bone. That should be good. So, of course, I wonder, I'm still confused about the whole, how this functions thing with the Koopalings. You know, they, they're only resistant to the replica of their, of the item they're weak against. Oh yeah, here we go. This should hurt you a lot. I'm expecting third to half his health. Depends on if he has a weird gimmick. It's very faint, but there is a blue star on the side of his face. Oh. <laughs> Bye, princess. Woo, he has a lot of health. Beautiful. Okay, so almost a third. Well, his hair gives him a lot of HP, it looks like. Are you shitting me? So I just wasted that turn. Wait. This engine isn't yours to simply do weird stuff with as you please. I'm gonna have the, I'm going to the cabin to stop that shy guy. Cover me. Well, well, that's one cheeky toad. Why can't he embrace his inner coward like all his friends? Crush that dirty toad. Uh, let's see. I need, oh, I can get another bone. So I'm not going to bother wasting items on Larry just yet. I'm going to kill these shy guys, though. We'll throw a boomerang guy out just for... Oh, shit, no. I don't want the boomerang. I need. I forgot I had to keep him. Woo! almost made a big mistake there. I'll send this guy out instead. Oh, he left the building. Dead, dead, dead. Right? Oh, wait. You can't use these guys on bosses. He just runs away. Right. Amateurs. Uh, I'm not afraid. Mario, please continue to cover me. Ow. Minions. Crush them. Awesome oh, stacks, huh? I don't know how to deal with coal guys. Fuck. Uh... I'm gonna get another thing. Oh, it's a she. It's the fucking stopwatch. In that case, I'll just get a fire flower from this one. Okay, and then. What things do I have? We'll use the. Oh, I have the plunger. Okay. So the plunger, and then I'll use. 
Do I have any double two shoes? I do. And the fire plug. Okay. Later, Larry. Oh, right, the weird music is in this one. Why is it so sexual? Well, that one's certainly dead. The stack probably won't die. Oh, it will! Okay. I did not know that. So things will kill stacks. What is the point of this bit of damage? This can't reach him, so there's no point. It's a learning, it's a learning experience, you know. Yeah, no shit. Amateurs. Come on, get down there. Just one step farther, I'm almost at the cabin. Yep. It's restored. Oh my god. Minions crush them. Okay, well now that I know how the stacks work. Oh, here's one I don't think I've ever used. Here's hoping it actually does damage. Oh no, it just dazes them? No, it killed the stack. Light bulb hurt their eyes. Oh, so now they'll miss. That's fine. What are you doing? Open your eyes. Oh, fuck me! So I wasted that whole turn. So he can just... He can just do that, huh? Okay, I'm getting the plunger again. That's good. How long is this episode already? It's getting lengthy. I'd like to wrap this up. This fight's annoying! Get him. I really wish you could skip these. I mean, yes, it's very funny. It's, yeah, it's a plunger. It's awesome. That one's dead. That one's dead. That one's dead. Alright, shit for brains. You're almost there. Please give me a good. Oh, the turnip! That's great. Okay, turnip, and just in case, I've got extra shoes. I'll waste these just in case someone doesn't doesn't someone survives this attack. I doubt it, though. Because maybe it's only the plunger that can kill stacks? I don't know. Nope, everything kills everything. If it does enough damage. So it has to be a damaging thing and not like an effect thing. Oh, he got healed. Nice. Alright, I did it. I chased the shy guy out of the cabin. Now we go give Larry the old what for. Ah, stupid toad. If you love engines so much, why don't you try to marry this smoke? Okay, I think now is the time for the corking? The 
corking? Where is the cork? Did I lose the cork? Wait, hold on. Get, um, let me get a pair of shoes. Or the cat. I can get the cat too, I guess. Where's the cork? Where's the cork? Oh, there's the cork. Okay. That. And then that. Why not? I mean, that's what the toad said was to use the cork. Oh, something special is happening. Stopped up my smokestack, you little pest. Why? What's the effect of me being all smoky? Watch out, Larry. Kitty cat's coming for you. Ooh, that did good damage. <laughs> Too smoky to see anything. Oh, good. I haven't lost yet. Fuck my life. That's a lot of ouch. Uh-oh, there's no things in this group. Faster. Well, not too fast, but. Okay. So we we'll use that, that, and I need to. Oh, cool. I thought I didn't have any giant mushrooms left. Larry's a bruiser. He's just gonna be literally old white with just a tuft of hair. Blue tuft of hair. God, that would have done 64 damage if I hadn't blocked it. Fuck that shit. Um, give me a thing. Ooh, salt and pepper. I don't know how those work as far as damage goes. Salt and pepper. And then a jump, and then a head. Huh? It didn't do anything. So I guess the salt and pepper is not a damaging one. It's an effect one. Look, he is just nothing but a tuft of hair. Okay, I have to heal or he'll kill me next turn if I don't block. Give me, give me a... I don't know what that one does either. God, I've used a lot of coins for this fight. Big mushroom. Um, oh boy. Double iron jump. And oh, he's very close to death. Oh, he's all limp. <laughs> Probably won't kill him, but it'll bring him close. If it does damage, I don't know what the... It's a can opener, isn't it? Oh, it's a bottle opener. That did no damage. That did absolutely nothing. Okay. 
What the actual fuck was that? Okay, fire flower. I can work with that. Alright, so fire flower, shoes. Um, sure, tail hand, why not? I need to wrap up this fight, my god! Oh, he's dead. He's a pile of ash. Jesus. What? No, this can't be. I, I lost. I can't ever face Lord Bowser again. I'll have to go on the lamb. No, maybe I'll go on the lamb. Lamb chop sounds pretty good, right? <laughs> Later, fart face. Train's about to pull into Starlight Cape for a final destination. Please take all your personal belongings with you. After all this hype, I can't wait to see what Starlight Cape is like. Oh, so you know what? I bet the train... You can ride the... I don't know. I don't know how it's going to work. We arrived at Starlight Cape. You must be tired after the long trip. Phew, we made it. Got a little dicey there, but I had fun. So there should be a big paint star somewhere around here around here somewhere. Let's see what we can find. Hmm. Any paint? No. This train was amazing. Thanks to the skilled hands of the guys over at Toad Train Works, it runs like new again. In fact, it runs with such incredible speed, it's hard to think that this is its last run. I couldn't think of retiring the train when it runs like this. It's still got a lifetime of journeys left in it. You're right. It's a waste for an engine that great to be retired. Let's keep it in commission. The Sunset, Ex Sunset Express deserves nothing less. Oh. Yay! I like trains. I like trains. Oh, look at that, Mario. The star-filled sky... That's not a star. That's not a star on the right there. The one is called Starlight Cape. No! Oh, a shooting star. Did you make a wish, Mario? You probably wish for Princess Peach to be safe, am I right? My wish is that we get all six back big paint stars back, of course. <clears throat> well, here's one. There it is, the big paint star, my wish. My wish is coming true. I bet that the shooting star heard my wish. That means that your wish will also come true, Mario. Let's grab the big paint star and keep trucking on together. So that just leaves one, theoretically, one big paint star, right? Hmm. So this is going to do something to the bones. Is it going to bring them back to... Hey, I got all the spots. Is it going to bring them back to life? Okay, it's made them orange. Okay, it did bring them back to life. What the shit? Huh. So that's a Dragodon. What the hell is that up there? So he's probably heading over to the volcano. Oh, that explains a lot. Huzzah! The big orange big paint star is back. 
I'm the orange big paint star. Remember what happened just before Bowser's army attacked Port Prisma? Let me show you what happened to Bowser. I warn you, it's not for the faint of heart. What happened to Bowser? Okay, he absorbed black paint. We already knew that. Oh, we've seen this part. Bowser got covered in black paint right here in Prisma Fountain. But why was there black paint black paint in Prisma Fountain in the first place? No matter reason no matter the reason, the black paint came from this very fountain. We need to find the last big paint star ASAP. Alright. Now what dance are we doing? No, oh, it's like an old western. Here's this here's paint country. Got the 175. Hello, restaurant guy on the roof. Yay. Okay, but before anything, I'm curious is there a new rail? Because I can't get to any of the other rail Rochambeau temples. Oh, neat. Alright, well, I guess, uh, I guess that's it for this episode. So we'll continue one star left in the next episode. So thanks for joining me. Come back on the next stuff up real soon. But until then, bye.